Hello, my friends, and welcome to my channel. I want to introduce you to the Relic Room, a Smoky Mountain Relic Room in uh, Seaverville, Tennessee. My friends went there and picked me up two bags from the Relic Room, and I was able to identify the stones from the two bags that they they picked up for me so I could do some of my wire weaving and make some jewelry out of these stones. They got me some really pretty stones. I think just absolutely beautiful. Some of these I've never seen before. This picture sandstone, I've never seen these before. They're absolutely beautiful. That is gonna make some really pretty jewelry. Green Abertine. I like the Prenite. This is one of my favorite stones here, of course, is the uh, moonstones. You know how I like them. I love that beautiful sheen that the moonstone has. The labyrinths. directional. It's gorgeous. Love it. Tiger Eye is another one that has that really pretty color to it. Isn't that beautiful? Love that. They'd cut this piece um, just shy of giving me that tiger eye glow to it. Kind of sad. Love the rose quartz. We've got us some really red, red jasper there. I'm new to the whole mukite, but it's very pretty. I like the mukite. All these are lovely polished rocks that they picked. They sat and they picked all of these out for me. Tried to pick me out sets. Isn't this picture Jasper so neat? It almost looks like it's a little globe on this one. Isn't that neat? That is so cool. Soda light has some really dark blue there to light blue. Never heard of Apache Tears before, but those are really pretty. A black stone and black chalcedony. Howlite I have heard of. That's one of the stones that they actually make the Native American jewelry out of. I've always heard them call it Buffalo Turquoise, but um, that's Howlite. Isn't that pretty? Orange quartz could even be a citrine. I mean, I'm not sure. This is just what the rock identifier called it, but it's really pretty. Nice big stone there. Clang. <laughs> now here is a nice banded uh, amethyst. Look at that band on there. You can really see it really showed up nice right there. You can see all the banding in there. So cool. It's got a chevron right there. And then this one, it didn't quite 
get all of the band in it, but it's still gorgeous amethyst in there with that white quartz. Isn't that so pretty? It's got a little bit of sparkle in there. You know how I like sparkles. Oh, so pretty. Look at it. It saved us some of that sparkle inside of there. So, so pretty. And here's Mozart I I'd never heard of that. It's got some interesting colors in there. Look at that. Isn't that neat? Love those colors. Ocean Jasper here. Look at the colors on that ocean jasper. Isn't that pretty? It's got some really dark blues right in there. Pretty, pretty ocean jasper. I called this an ocean jasper too, but it really to me almost looks like it is an, an agate. Like it's been cut. This one here looks like I just put it in an agate because it looks like it's got part of an outer band and an inner band in here that I just couldn't identify it. But it might be crazy lace, but I can't tell. Rose quartz, beautiful pinks. And here's our crazy lace. This one is just the lacy part right here. This one looks like a Michigan crazy lace agate. Isn't that so cool? There's no eyes on it, so it's just a crazy lace. Look at all that. It's so pretty. Gotta love it right there. You really see it. I'd never heard of this one here. The, the skull sight. I'm not sure if this one really goes in it. These ones here are super white. And then you got this one that's got a little almost uh, clear parts to it. But, I don't know, just a tad different. Now I did wire wrap one of those. My cat attacked it. Got really pretty. I did a wire weave with it. Turned out pretty nice. Now it told us that this one was fluorite. I really don't think it is. I think it's amethyst. That's sunset. Uh, so the light. Grab the wrong one anyway. Wow, they're so slippery when they're polished. <laughs> Sorry. Really pretty. That was the lion skin. This one's purpley. Colored and very sparkly. It listed it as Lepidolite. I'd never heard of that one. This one's a really beautiful agate right here. It's like it's got a little window inside. Isn't that just beautiful? That is going to make an absolutely stunning pendant. Look at the back of that. It is so pretty. One of my favorites. Alright, now we're down at the bottom. That one said it was a Dumertierite, it's a blue, a blue colored stone. I don't think it got it right on the name, but I don't, it didn't kick out any other name for me and I don't know what it is. The Prionite is absolutely dead on. That's what both of these are. It's a very pale green, got a lot of, it's translucent. Very pretty.
I love this kyanite here. This one has a lot of um, see you can see through it. It's really beautiful. I've got a small one that I that was round. I made a, a pendant out of it. Looks very similar to this except it's round. This is the uh, it, this has some of the host rock on it. That's why it looks like this compared to that. It's got the 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 kyanite at the bottom, but the, has the host rock up here at the top. Here's some pretty jadeite. Very pretty. And I'd never heard of this one, the Vesuvianite. It's very dark green. Very pretty. So, let me know what one was your favorite in the batch. And let me know if you enjoyed this video. I wanted to make sure to let everybody know what the stones were, so I tried to identify all of them for you. So you know, all of these are beautiful polished rocks. Now you can go to the website. It's Their website's called The Relic Room. Um, so you can just go there and, and you can get, you can buy the, a bag of these if you want a bag of polished rocks. And they're quite affordable. And it's free. Uh, when I looked on there, I think it said free shipping. So very nice. Very, very nice. I am so happy. Thank you so much for this beautiful, beautiful gift. Shout out to my friend uh, JT and Kay. I appreciate it so much. I love each and every one of them. It was a great, great gift you got for me. And thank you to all of my friends for joining me on this episode. Have a beautiful, beautiful day.